All right, Herman the Hive. This is week six. Things have been going well. We opened up the hive and last week and things were exploding. We're gonna add another super today and then I'm just gonna give some basic bee terminology and go through that. This is burr comb. Burr comb is whenever bees build something that you don't want. This is burr comb built on the top of the box. So I just removed that. <laughs> this is burr comb built on the bottom of the frame. This has been there for a few weeks and it had larvae in it a while back that looks like it's hatched. So I went ahead and removed it now that it's mostly empty. This is capped honey. Bees collect nectar from flowers and store it and then dehydrate it into honey. Once it's appropriately dehydrated, they cap it over with wax and that gets that white covering. These are drone cells. They're a little bit raised. It's hard to tell from this. Drone cells are going to hatch into drones, which are male bees. Male bees cannot sting anyone. They don't have stingers. Uh, their sole purpose in life is to mate with queens and propagate the species. Um, they also do not do any foraging or, or anything of that nature. They're pretty much worthless and require feeding from the nurse bees. Talk a little bit about brood patterns. That just refers to the way that the bees lay their eggs. This frame here, you can see the outer edges are covered in honey, and then you got this inner circle that's full of brood. Brood refers to eggs, larvae, pupae in all stages here. <clears throat> in this particular shot, uh, you see a bunch of capped brood, and then there's these holes. A lot of that contains either honey or pollen used to feed the brood. This is similar, so the top is all honey, and then all this half circle bottom is brood and larvae. So as I zoom in here, you can see the larvae down in each of the cells, um, and the bees will work on capping that over as you see some of the cells that have been capped over and once they're capped over they will start to turn into pupae into bees. This is a foundationless frame. This just refers to them building honeycomb without a foundation and they just draw it from the top and bring it down. While we were working through the hive we stumbled across our queen. She's still happy and healthy and laying lots of eggs and now she's just going to the other side of the frame. Here we are closing up the hive. We added a third box. Each bee box is called a super. So this is the third super. Another fun fact about bees is that to cool their hive, they use a form of thermoregulation. The bees will organize themselves together and usually at the front of the hive, sometimes even coming out and wrapping themselves around the hive and beat their wings in unison to pump out the hot air and create circulation. Uh, they will also do this inside the hive on the honey frames to help dehydrate them. It's a pretty cool thing to watch. <laughs>